Well, hey YouTube, so today guys, we're back here with another review, and today we have a review here of none other than Reynolds Wrap. And I know what you guys are thinking, you know, I do seem kind of desperate now for, for products to review. Why are you reviewing our Reynolds Wrap here? And I, I can assure you guys that's not the case. I do have stuff coming in the mail soon. But I just feel like, why not, man? There's not many people talking about it on YouTube, right? That's, you know, I look for niches and stuff like that. And I feel like, you know, there, there needs to be a proper review on YouTube for Reynolds Wrap, okay? So basically what Reynolds Wrap is, it's basically the uh, definitive brand of aluminum foil in the uh, United States. I don't know what uh, United Kingdom or European Union or Asia, I don't know what they uh, tend to use. Probably some type of brand that they have locally. But in the United States, Reynolds Wrap is the, uh, I mean, this this name is such a, this brand is such a definitive name in the aluminum foil industry that people just call aluminum foil Reynolds Wrap these days. They're interchangeable, and I've seen people just call it that. It's like when people call Band-Aids a Band-Aid, I mean, that's a brand name. It's really, it's really just a small bandage. A bandage is, is the generic term, but Band-Aid is a company, right? And they sell Band-Aids and they kind of own that trademark name and it's very valuable. Reynolds Wrap is another example of a name that's become so synonymous with aluminum foil that they're used interchangeably in the United States, at least. So, you know, what is it? What exactly is this for if you're not somebody who cooks too much? So basically, guys, when you put when you put your food in the oven, right, the pan that you have to use is kind of gets kind of dirty and rusty over time. And the truth is, it's, un it's, it's just unsanitary. And the truth is, you don't really wash that thing for whatever reason. It's just not customary to actually uh, wash that pan right so what people do is they put aluminum foil over it which is safe enough to be used in the oven this can handle very very high temperature that's because this is made from aluminum which is a metal metals are known for having very very high melting points compared to uh, other materials which is why aluminum foil is used and obviously aluminum is like probably one of the more cheaper metals to uh, manufacture typically stuff like titanium you know, platinum gold, all that, you know, all that stuff, all that stuff is rare, expensive, or just hard to produce, but aluminum is commonly occurring, and it's, you know, it's metal, which means it has the uh, high, uh, melting point, and all that, you know, great stuff here, so, you know, it's, it's always customary to, uh, you know, to open it up like this, and it always comes with the, uh, the sharp points here, you just kind of, like that, yeah, that's kind of how aluminum foil has always been, and, I, I can't think of a, of a product that hasn't had that in the aluminum foil space. I'm sure, I'm sure there's, no, there's other ways of doing it. Sometimes I see like the little uh, zipper thing, kind of, kind of just take it, kind of, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm talking about? Sometimes I've seen that, but for the most part, you know, this is a typical mechanism used on a handheld household uh, aluminum foil container. So this one has about, this is the standard size. This has about 30 uh, square feet. So. Maybe you didn't know how long it is. Well, this is telling you now. This is about 30 uh, square feet. So this room here, my room, I don't know exactly how big it is. It's probably about two and a half my wingspan. My wingspan is about five, seven, five, eight. So 10 feet. Yeah, it's about, it's about 12 to 15 feet, my room. So this thing would go across my room to, to, uh, two times. So that's about how long it is. If you were to take out the roll and you would, you know, stretch it out all the way. You know what I'm saying? So that's, uh, that's really, really cool here. You know, obviously just, just be aware you really can't put this in a microwave because microwave, uh, utilizes a different technology and a very, very thin metal like this would explode. It would explode. Basically when it comes to microwaving stuff, you're going to use metal. I don't recommend it. But if you are, pick something that has a very high surface area, right? Like if you have like, you take this entire roll, for some reason you put this in a microwave, maybe it wouldn't explode under a short period of time because the surface area is quite large. But you take something like this, which has a pretty small surface area relative to the size of the microwave, relative to the entire roll, this will explode very quickly. So just be aware of that. Don't put this in the microwave at all, really. You really shouldn't do it, you know. But yeah, overall, guys, yeah. I mean, it's more of a science lesson almost. And I'm sorry about that. But I do like science. I do like analyzing stuff. And I just think, you know, I think I have some cool stuff to talk about. Because I, I know a lot about this product. Because you see it everywhere in the United States. It's just, you know, it's just everywhere, you know. So, guys, let me, let me know down below if you live in a different country. You know, what, what brands do you guys get the aluminum foil? Because this is really the only choice I even see. And sometimes you have the uh, private label brands. You know, obviously, Walmart has their private Sam's Club aluminum foil, uh, CVS has their private, uh, great value brand, uh, I mean, you know what I'm saying, so you have those private value ones, but this is the brand you would see everywhere, no matter where you are in the country, so really hope you guys enjoyed that video, if you want to buy some, I mean, does the job, man, you cook in anything in the oven, you need this, uh, Amazon link will be down below, make sure you guys uh, subscribe and like for daily news and reviews, and don't forget to check out pbosonline.com, you got reviews, gameplay, news, videos, shopping, 
all that great stuff on my websites. Check it out. We really hope you enjoyed that video. Thank you and bye.